it's a parent like yeah you naturally worry especially mothers you worry for your kids you worry for your kids future or present also because the parents are the one that raise them up bring them up clothe them give them some duit jajan you know pocket money to spend so naturally as parents this is our nurturing and protective instinct but we are not going to be around forever right uh, we are not going to be around forever so we cannot be 100 percent total control you know uh, i think what's important for me my own belief lah is that we need to equip them with the skills Okay, equip them with the skills. The problems that come with it will always change. Yeah, uh, 20 years ago was different, slightly different due to different technology. 20 years later now also different. In between the 20 years and the 10 year mark also different. Tomorrow will also be different. It's not just about housing. Uh. It's just in general, uh, how do you survive on this earth, in this world? Yeah. So that's why I believe that no need to worry about how they are going to live but focus on what are we going to impart to them you know don't give them the money uh, let them work for it don't give them the money so must equip them with the skills ah. skills what life skills can we equip them with what uh, the technical skills and also uh, theory uh, knowledge that this is the part where education is important so going to school is not just learning about academic stuff yeah it's about learning how to have eq skills social skills interact with friends also networking because tomorrow you do not know your friend become what right uh, so you can help one another in, in a close network so that's that's the key thing lah skills and knowledge okay technical part and the theoretical part and merge the two together uh, that's what i feel lah so don't worry so much about whether they're going they will they will be able to okay and even if everybody cannot afford then due to supply and demand the price will come down right when the price come down then they will be able to afford it will take care of itself okay it will take care of itself no need to worry oh i want to give my house to my children i want to let them inherit no don't give them the fish uh, I, that's my belief lah don't give them the fish teach them how to fish okay uh, your house is your house you deserve it you work hard all these years you deserve it you don't worry about giving it to them they will know lah they will know what to do whether or not they you leave behind them stuff you know this is a 10 year series question <laughs> this is a 10 year series life question every time parents leave behind for their children something money or asset house whatever lah always will fight one huh? 9 out of 10 times always will fight why we want to let them fight don't give them anything is the best then they got to crack their head and figure out how to navigate life teach them proper financial knowledge ah this one this one is really important huh? a lot of us got no proper financial knowledge because this is not taught in school primary school don't teach secondary school don't teach Heck, tertiary education also don't teach. They only teach you the skills that is required for you to be a good employee at work. That's all. Personal finance, these are the things that most of the time is taught by parents. Or nowadays you have YouTube and you have uh, internet for you to learn personal finance or for just finance in general. But to know and to execute are two different things all together uh, so i think the financial literacy portion is very very important 
Okay And it matters who you take your advice from <laughs> It matters who you mix around It matters who your friends are Because If you take Advice from a person who he himself or her him herself Cannot sort out their personal finance Right? You must Listen to those or take advice Be selective who you listen or who you take your advice from uh, When it comes to financial literacy Okay? In general, uh, not just property In general Yeah? Savings Investments if you are into it But most of us are uh, if at the basic level, basic level, don't even think about investment yet lah. Just sort out your cash flow first. Okay, a lot of people have problem with the cash flow portion. Very little in, so many out. Uh, salary only is the only component that is in. But then the out cash flow out is like, don't know why you all keep collecting. I know lah. I know. I'm just you know, you know what I mean. Uh, so. Try to find ways on how to increase the cash flow in And then limit or restrict the cash flow out Tada! That's the basic 101 Marwan, collecting my BTO key soon Hakim, so happy at last Dapat my house Congratulations Marwan, so happy for you Small, small thing, don't worry How they grow up 23 have a very good point also Small small thing Sometimes ah We often overlook The The character building ah, Can I say that character building What kind of values What kind of morals And this is again not taught in what you, you expect Civic moral education ah. Now, now I don't know what is it called. Uh. Last time, during my school days, is civic moral education. You expect that to teach your kids moral and values. Uh. No, uh. This is something that is exemplified by parents. By us, parents. They are watching, no. They are mimicking us. All our bad habits at home, me included, I'm guilty of this. All your bad habits at home, all your melata, all your... F King language, you know. Uh, so they are watching, and then we we punish them based on what they mimic us. <laughs> yeah, they are no bad children, only bad parents. Take responsibility, take ownership over your children. Uh, we parents need to do a better job, especially in today's world. Thank you for sharing. Most people, I ask, blame government. Normal lah Human beings always Don't want to take responsibility Don't want to take ownership Always blame other people That's the most convenient thing to do We never ever look Inside ourselves Yeah We just say It's his fault lah It's her fault lah It's everybody It's the whole world So it's God's fault Okay the only person that is not to be blamed is me This is human being This is human being So we need to reverse Remove The victim mindset And say that everything that happened in my life Is my fault I am responsible for it It is because of me That I made Bad friends that lead me in my current situation It's because of me That I never go and get a better job To provide for my family It's because of me Everything is because of me Nobody else is at fault Okay, me So work on the me Yeah, work on the me Good morning Selamat pagi Puan Kamalia Mr. Rizdian Izbin Tara Good morning You are here this morning bro you're here this morning So what do you think of my My thoughts so far Ming My parents left me CPF When I get it I give it to some of my siblings 
now no connection at all this one this one starts from young uh. yeah the relationship between siblings and this is another 10 year series question the relationship within siblings starts at the very young age the age where you are still we are still kids you know so we, we got to nurture the relationship at that very young age then slowly growing up start working especially so being emphasized the moment we get married because the moment we get married spouses are involved already and then the in-laws come into play yeah who you bury is very important from a family perspective can come or not obey gum yeah so that that is very important in terms of siblings relationship uh, the siblings need to be okay with the spouse but of course in the first place the siblings must have a good tight relationship uh. Uh, so when when the relationship is tight and then you bring in you on board the in-laws that can come change and get along with your siblings then it becomes a wonderful relationship to be having on this earth right otherwise like I mentioned uh, 10 years serious question a lot of most of us uh, don't say other people like me uh, most of us get it wrong relationship very sour very bad money money in the picture will all come money no money already all go away the relationship is based on money your family relationship, your sibling relationship is based on your 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 family and sibling relationship is just based on money. Seriously, is that the meaning of life? So I think lah, you got it's got to be more than that, right? It's like I got your back, you know. Like I got your back, right? Not my brother, Azik. Are you here now, Azik? Salam Hakim, suddenly, suddenly seeing you on TikTok, Rudy. Hey, ini Rudy mana ni? Which part of my life? <laughs> Which part of my life did you appear last time? Primary school, secondary school, poly, uni. Which one? Work. Which Rudy? Institute of Mental Health. What is highest? What is your highest level of education? Uh, degree in Econs, Economics and Finance I, I never take Masters uh. PhD PhD I waiting for my wife to take I don't have PhD also Semangat daily walk discipline Of course Of course Day 15 guys Day 15 Every morning you all accompany me Day 15 Arrow of my way Who is arrow of my way? Eh? Is it first time? Morning arrow Mr. Rushdi is here bro We haven't caught up in a long time Mr. Rushdi Let's arrange something Salam, all's agreed Where is all's agreed? Is this Bukit Timah? Not yet This is just before Bukit Timah This is Bukit Panjang after Bukit Panjang Then Bukit Timah Last time For this cartoon POSB Squirrel Advertise Save money Yeah But cannot just base on the squirrel lah Oh That one Bank have his, their own agenda But it's a good start Save money Saving is like a lost art you know Nobody saves today That's what I realised lah Everybody just spend only Talk about all the wonderful things also Because they like the excitement of investment Investment lah Crypto lah What lah Eh, who stay here? Blossom Residence How's this place nice or not? How's your view? Do you like the road sound? Of the expressway? Uh, I haven't checked this condo out Yeah So yeah lah Saving is like a lost art lah Mm. It's, it's something that we need We need to pass over Pass on to our children The next generation 
Sometimes I ask myself, what am I doing to teach my children how to save? Basic component, uh, basic building block. Saving. Sharing you can buy resale with grants. If you have received your grants, then no. If you have not received your grants, then yes. Because I submit the cancellation form. Okay, Sherry, you got to ask the HDB officer. Uh, no, you check your CPF account whether the grants have been disbursed and deposited into your CPF account. If you did receive, unfortunately, that's it. If you have not received, then you can get the full grants. Perpetual quotes, Judge Lim. You, that's a good one. Uh. That is the first. Huh? <laughs> Hakim Halim, you translate it to Judge Lim. That's a nice one. Ooh, I see bread. I see waffles. I see peanut butter waffles. Yum yum. Practice what you preach. Yeah lah. Practice what you preach. I also try my best to practice. Where am I supposed to turn in? Think here. Let's walk here a little bit. Hello, my house ready in Q4 2024. Just started job in January. Hey, I don't know. The answer is I don't know. I don't know how many gaps you have. All right? Okay, but but the answer you want to hear from me is you will be fine. Okay? You will be fine as long as you have you are holding on to a job. Okay, just take it. Just take it as you will be fine as long as you're holding on to a job. When the time comes, then you address accordingly. Siblings are crap. Talk behind, in front of you, nice. Yeah la. Sometimes human beings are like that, what? Huh? The re like, like I said earlier, uh, the relationship needs to be cherry blossom from young. Uh, that one very important. So I say in general uh, because every one of us have different dynamics and chemistry with our own siblings. Uh. Uh, so I just say in general. So the two points. Number one, from young must inculcate the positive relationship. Uh, must give and take. Uh. Cannot every time take only. Must give and take a bit. Okay, sikit lebih kurang. Uh, the elder one always give in. Mengalah. Lose never mind. You know, give in to your younger ones, your younger siblings. Don't everything have to win. The elder one is when you're growing up, naturally you're smarter than the younger ones for a start in the first few years. Because your brain develops faster than them. They are still developing. They're still at kindergarten, you primary one already. They're still at primary school, you secondary school already. Right? So must Give and take lah, give in. Yeah? Give in. Give in doesn't mean lose what. You want to fight with your sibling for what? Uh, then the second point is the point you get married. Uh, this one I cannot emphasize. I cannot emphasize more. Who you marry is important. Yeah? What I learned for myself is who you marry is not just about oh love, love, love. Yeah, yeah, love, love is love lah. Okay, that one no issue. That one you know how to settle. Figure out the other criteria. Is it a good fit? Is the family a good fit? Is the relationship with my siblings a good fit? With their siblings a good fit? Birds of feather flock together, right? Uh, are, it cannot just be one criteria, love. You know what? Life is not just about love. There will be crises in life 
maybe good moments but most of the time is how you navigate the bad times the crisis yeah those are the moments that you will remember opportunity to navigate crisis together morning morning i don't have my name siblings after having their own family changes you see i just said <laughs> I just said This is Australia Does this look like Australia to you? Uh, maybe uh, Just Don't have koala bear only Don't be surprised <coughs> Excuse me <coughs> Don't be surprised I pop by in one of your morning walks Of course By all means You are most welcome Just pop by lah Oh, just pop by. Maybe you can motivate me. Instead of just walking, motivate me to run also. Uh. No, siblings in the 70s totally different. Right? Right? Why last time siblings had better relationship? Huh? Because you all suffer together, right? You grew up together, there were no mobile devices, there was no internet Everything is boring So bored Then you go out and do shit together huh. You play catch spiders together You play marble together You do everything together, all the activities is together Nowadays we are just in front of all our devices TikTok life we don't do the human interaction activities together That's why How like that? It feels like there is no turning back uh, at this point of juncture uh. So those who live in the 70s, 80s, maybe 90, 90s uh, You all know what I'm talking about uh, No internet, no mobile phone I want to meet my friend at 4 later 5pm, meet me at the MRT uh. Uh, You look for me uh. I'm wearing the white color t-shirt Ah, okay, I wait for you at the at the top up machine. Okay, I see you there. I see you there later. Five o'clock. Ah, tomorrow. Ah, don't forget. Ah. ah, no more already. And then you wait there. No matter what, you also wait there. Late fifteen minute wait, half an hour wait, one hour wait. Yeah, before pager, before pager. Until your friend turn up. Until your brother turn up. Right. Then, oh, why you late? Okay, let's go makan. I belanja you. I belanja you. These moments no more already, no. I miss them. It was so beautiful. So memorable. You bought, you go to your house. Eh, eh uh, I go to your house. I go to your house. We play game together. Uh. Uh, I go, we study together. Uh. Yeah, right. Study. Banyak yang study. That's how we used to hang out. Last time. Human to human interaction Now Everybody on their mobile device Want to walk in the morning also with their mobile device ah, yeah. Don't know what to say oh, You all agree or not? How many of you had such sweet memories? When you grew up last time without internet and any of the mobile device <laughs> Got people safe lah, so many news of people kena wiped out from scam These are often the older generation The younger generation, I'm not sure whether they safe or not How long is your walk every day, bro? Yeah, so the target is sometimes I clock 8,000. 7,000 is the least I think I saw. Maximum was like 10, 12, uh, no, 10, 11,000. So I think anywhere between 5 to 8 kilometers like that. About one hour, slightly more than one hour. You know? My Sarah, sometimes difficult lah, bang, to save. Sure got something to buy If you say difficult, it will be difficult lah. If you say can Then can lah. you decide 
This one very very powerful no? You decide uh. Zul Morning bro Question Can down payment for BTO be delayed Till I sell my current flat I think somebody did this uh. You write into HDB By default no uh, cannot You must pay for the down payment you try right in and see whether it can differ or not. Uh. Ask Agent Kai. Good morning, bro. Morning, Agent Kai. Morning, Petu Sergeant. How come government will fine us for holding on to a job? What do you mean? Are you referring to tax? What do I mean by fine you for holding into a, onto a job? Why would they fine you? Welita Tamin, my neighborhood Sega Road. We are in the same neighborhood. Welita. Kai Shazwan, good morning, sir. Chris, important, make more babies. This one also often overlooked. Uh, make more babies portion. Sometimes, uh, we a little bit. I say me, lah. Me, okay? Human being. We are a little bit too, too howlian lah. Too action no? Or later lah, later then I want to have children. Now I want to enjoy first. Huh? Nothing wrong, you can do your own planning. But it is not a given that you can have babies, that you will be blessed with having children. Automatically, it's not a given. It's no guarantee, you know. So start early lah. <laughs> Start early ah. You don't want to be old and still trying to feed your baby at night when you're old. No what? Start early ah. Have your finances ready. Have your plans ready in place. But don't... Uh, don't what ah? Don't underestimate ah. Uh, don't underestimate the blessing of having children early. Uh, caveat ah. You must be somewhat stable lah huh? Confident enough Don't got no job, both of you no job also Then make so many babies lah That is one extreme And then the other extreme don't want to have Want to delay having children Take the middle path lah You just passed my house Wow Where you stay? Is it the Chesterville EC? Wow, thank you Puan Kamalia Thank you very much Give me 20 Hearts Okay, is it the time now to do pull up? Oh no, now I'm feeling the nervousness Of the doing the sprint So later we do a 10 second sprint See whether I can clock 100 meters in 10 seconds World record World Bukit Panjang record okay. uh, Boss Kalau nak jadi agent Boleh sign up tak? Sign up je <laughs> Sign up Just sign up ni Sign up for the RES course Sign up for the RES exam Then okay Settle already Very easy Can Can Gen Z now spend spend Food and play Not enough borrow Or take from parents Live today like no tomorrow <laughs> What's new right What's new So yeah lah We have no one else to blame But the parents ah. Right Good morning Mr. Azar Sulaiman Give me a rose plus prata Hey bro, I want to tell you something The other day I went to the Lucky Plaza Nasi Ayam place again The level 6 that one The one that you brought me the first time Wow, bad experience Bad experience The person I didn't I didn't know must queue first I didn't know cannot sit down Okay 
So I sit down, sit down, then my brother go and queue for the nasi ayam, right? Then the person go, hello, brother, queue first, ah. To some people, it may be funny, ah. But from a customer service point of view, from wouldn't that make customers go away? Yeah. So not the best experience. Like in the end, because of because of the attitude, we decided to go to Ayam Penyet Ria, which had plentiful more space cleaner I mean the food is okay but customer experience ah customer service no matter how fantastic your food but your customer service is then how I just want to rent on me lah sorry sorry feedback feedback I know it's not your shop but you reminded me of the nasi ayam. Last time, people go walk where do like. <laughs> yeah lah. Only me ah. No lah. Of course, got other people lah. But in Bukit Panjang, morning 8:30 a.m. Me. For now, until you all join me. Can you imagine that I walk every morning? Then you all walk behind me. Huh? You all walk behind me. Wouldn't that be awesome? A new movement to keep fit and exercise for all the Bukit Panjang residents here. Bro, you from SRI or Propnex? I'm from Propnex. Blue team. Ah, blue team. Ah. Actually, Hakim. You should hold a group walk. You see, I just said it. And now you second it. I concur. Huh. Firjana, last time no mobile and internet. Still enjoy life, right? You enjoy life better, right? And can meet up with, can meet up on time some more. Exactly. Okay, guys. The Chinap bus seems to be empty. Let's do one set of chin up. Hellbender. Uncle. Call me uncle again. How is the market for two room? Okay lah. The market still there. Still in existence. Everything. Is it on the high side? Everything is on the high side lah. Including your two room. Okay. No worry. Everything is on the high side. Assalamualaikum I DM you I would love to invite you and your followers For hiking on Monday <laughs> I don't know whether I can survive your hiking or not <laughs> I will make do with a walk But yeah lah, can DM me Steven, good morning Hakim Good morning Okay, we are going to do Our one set of pull up Yes, yes, only one set of pull up So no need to stress lah Right Six to pass uh, if get lesser than 6 Then must go for remedial lesson Okay Must go for RT ready Megan Megan Markle also cannot get along with Kate Middleton Sisters in laws Always cannot get along Ah, This was my Number one Advice given by my mother who you choose must get along with your sister-in-law. Ah, don't get along, find another one. That was my number one advice from my mother. Okay. Uh, let me quickly scroll through before I do my pull-up. Ah, so I can catch my breath also. Buy resale with grant. Then house on block. Then move to on block unit. Can still buy new EC. Can just pay levy only. Cannot find love. How to start early? Start dating lah. See all the answer very easy, and you all know all the answer. You all still just want affirmation from me, right? 
Uh. Cannot find love. Start dating lah. You never did how you find love. Now got internet what even more easier. Right? Can scroll so many profiles. I do not know which program you use or which app you use. Start early. Good morning, Mr. Kamal. Mr. Kamal joined us today. Okay, Mr. Kamal, I clear already. Kamalia, thank you, Kamalia. Azar Sulaiman, give me gifts. Thank you, Mr. Azar Sulaiman. Chris, we cannot blame anyone, of course. Blame only ourselves. Don't blame anyone else. That's called store traffic control. <laughs> okay, my name is Dangerous. Mine is why sitting while waiting. Cause Ramai, the guy, used the plate and not. Oh, you see? You see, suddenly all the review all come out already. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Sikit sikit lah. And us to go away. Ah, ah. Ah. No customer service. <laughs> Got national service. You can go out and tell nicely. Don't need to knock and ask to stand up. Exactly. We can say, uh, hello, excuse me. Uh, don't mind, uh, don't mind. Uh. Uh, we queue first, then after that, we sit down. We give priority to those who come first. Uh, say, can say nicely what? Cost you $1,000. Uh. Can talk nicely what? So there is a difference. There is the difference. Uh, this one a learning lesson when you talk to your seller's agent. There is a difference if you try to show your stripes and then you speak with kind words to your seller's agent or to your buyer's agent okay this is called adab ha. this also must teach you guys hey, hey, sorry me 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 not you guys good morning good morning Bezo. so that's why i suggest group work that's why lah okay open invitation okay open invitation every morning rain or shine say rain or shine i'm here for the past 15 walks except for sunday Monday to Saturday I'm here I've been here I was here Currently I'm here You all just come And walk behind me And then I do that And then you will appear On my TikTok live With everybody Like the whole Singapore see Padahal only got 44 people only You in which jungle now? Brunei Yes join No 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 don't join the RC morning walk. Boring. Got no TikTok live. Join Hakim Halim morning walk. Why you want to join RC morning walk? I also from blue team. But my blue got a bit orange also. <laughs> Apa kau berbual? What you mean got a bit orange? Hai Mambang. Salam boss. Keep it the great workout. Yeah. Muhammad Nabawi. Can we apply for BTO while still having HDB? Yes. Only after your MOP. Jumpa wild boar tak? No, there's no wild boar here. Here got a lot of monkey. Monkey see, monkey do ni. Tomorrow what time? Every day. 8.30 bro. 8.30. Only for Bukit Pak actually no lah. Bukit Pajar Residence, Tampines, Pasiris, wherever lah you can come. Tomorrow walk where? Here. Same place. Do the same shit. In the same location. Again and again and again and again. Discipline. It is boring, yes. But you just keep doing it. And persevere. Okay. Oh, Hartons. Hartons. Sorry, I don't. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot the colors. Yeah, yeah. Hartons, Hartons. Okay, now we do the chin up. Ah, uh, okay. What other excuse you want to give? Do the chin up. How? How many can do today? Can do fifteen or not? 20 ah? Can. Must be positive. Can do one. Sorry behind your video, is it? No, no, no. If you don't mind, do it.
lepas ready six clean pull up six ah ha. tomorrow maybe 16 you know ha. okay see you you too okay come back to our walk got time to walk at dairy farm yeah i think got time to walk at dairy farm i love the dairy farm area that one the scenery much better let's do one round at the dairy farm huh wow sorry and pretty rich very good ah very strong side burn also very long ah you all know that one from where not Nizam Bay Good morning bro Coming to join us for our morning walk Good form Wah, thank you, thank you, thank you Wah, you give me words of encouragement ah. Ah. Slow and steady ya. Ah. I always, I always howlian to my children Last time Bapak do 26 pull up you know During army days That one last time now fat really, see all the tummy Last time is last time, now is now Oh, coming to 40 really Mr. Shelby Assalamualaikum, have a great day everyone Zach Zain, ah, correct Army days Last time I love to watch that What to do, I grew up with that one Alright my friend above 50 all get frozen shoulder You go to the Chris Leong <laughs> You know the Tita Tita what ah? Tita T Tita T Tita what ah? Bone setting ah? Chiropractic bone setting ah, And then you ask him to Do the mm, 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 mm. Ah, Settle already huh? Anybody got tried that one before or not? Do the bone setting with the mm 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 Settle Never do exercise get folded shoulder Hakim is 50 How do I look for a 50 year old? Still looking good? Not yet ah 40 only Coming to 40 That one also not yet 40 I always need to remind myself Q number Not call in sequence Santang can be earlier Chris Leong mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Wah somebody got try before Try already no use Only for that day lose a bit <laughs> I haven't tried uh. I haven't tried yet So I can't I can't say so much Always in sequence Until 99 No lah Who say one huh? Okay lah okay la. We work towards that we work to our best of ability and work towards the 99 because HDB got a 99 year lease, right? We slowly like, we slowly work towards that. But uh yeah lah. Live live kindly, live positively, like today is our last day. Can I say that? Spread kindness, be nice to one another. Like today is our last day. And then that changes everything in life, right? Today is our last day. As if. So in terms of mental, in terms of how you view things, emotional, spiritual, everything will change. Because today you live as if today is your last day. I tried before with his student in Singapore 
Oh, the one in the CBD that one, right? Hey, Hamizan, thank you for the reminder. Uh. Had apple and blueberries for breakfast. Water fasting now till 6 p.m. Good morning. I think this is very valuable advice. Uh. I haven't got my apples and strawberry. Sometimes, uh, the one... The one that we are supposed to eat, the natural foods that God has already given us, we never eat. We go and eat all the crap. Cereal lah, bread lah, what lah. Mana tak gemuk? You are right, no? I think the berries and strawberries are good alternative. And the fasting thingy. Take care of yourself, bang. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey, I ask you all lah. What do you think ah? Do you think the prices? Okay, don't talk about private ah. Don't talk about private, okay? Private different category really. Uh, do you think the prices for HDB right now, not for tomorrow ah? Now, 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 for the average Singaporean, is it still within affordability with all the grants and everything? Or is it too expensive? Okay, I won't say like that. Everybody will say too expensive. Is it still can afford or not? If a family wants to buy a minimum three room or four room lah, in today's context, is it still affordable? Is it an income problem? Is it an income problem or price problem? Huh. What are your thoughts? Ah? Is it the person income? Of course, of course you can't come and tell me that you are unemployed. Lah. That one is a no-brainer, okay? <coughs> but is it an income problem? Or a price problem? Cannot afford. <laughs> Hi, why you say cannot afford? Tell me, tell me, why you say cannot afford? Yes, can afford, you see? Ah, super size. Yes, can afford. Must see location. Ah, so sometimes need to sacrifice it. Need to sacrifice something lah in exchange for something. You cannot have all the stars aligned, right? Sometimes you need to sacrifice location. Sometimes your kids need to change school. Sometimes you just got to do whatever it takes. Very good point, very good point. Eddie, still affordable if both working. Thinking into context, other expenditures. Well, that's a very good point. Eh? Taking into context, other expenditures. Hey, let's walk here. Still okay, right? <coughs> still okay, right? Because I imagine... I imagine... Uh, tougher scenario would be even when both working cannot afford end up have to rent and not and not public housing rent uh, means open market rent you know like what you see in other cities in the world maybe like Paris or New York not everybody can afford people just rent Demand and supply is the answer. Of course lah bro. You and I know demand and supply is the answer. But I just want to get a sensing on the ground. Husband working. No. Husband and wife working. And one kid average cukup. Cukup makan aja. Okay. Mr. Sa for context. How many room are you currently staying? Three room, four room, five room. Income and price problem. How can it be near? Of course, lah, guys. With inflation, we can, to be to be to be honest, ah, with inflation, ah, with how the monetary system in the world, not just in Singapore, 
in the world is in the long run prices will always go up you know? prices will always go up unless you see some crisis in the world happening you know economic recession economic depression then you might see a lot of panic happening in the market lah. Uh, but other than that still even then you see the trajectory past 20 years 30 years 40 years prices are not going to go back like how it was before so the only thing that we can control is actually our income we cannot control so much the price of the market price of the market we are price taker depends on the economy right depends on demand and supply at that point of time right but we have better control on the income better control meaning that if we feel we need to upgrade our skill we upgrade we feel that we need to further studies further studies we feel that we need to start a business we start a business whatever whatever it takes but it's something that is still within our control yeah just that you know not everybody is willing to go through uh, not everybody is willing to go through the morning walk if i can put it in the metaphor Assalamualaikum Waalaikumsalam Nur Cahaya Zara Busy eh Siren Of course This one feels like kampung you know All the rooster The chicken Wow morning walk Yes Dah dekat habis pun Good morning thoughtful Hakim Good morning conflict tiger Wah wah ok ok We have an agent commenting already I'm single 3 room flat Ok bro Thank you for sharing Ming, my daughter now 21, haven't married. Okay, she planning to get married. Earning only 2.5k when she reached 30. Still affordable. That's nine more years to go. Nine more years to go. If I think positively, nine more years of opportunity for her to double or triple her income in nine years. So I think plenty of opportunity. I'm giving a very optimistic point of view. Okay? Nine years of opportunity for her to double and triple, maybe more, her current income. Nine years is a lot of time. Huh? Saf, Adam, bought it in 2003, single scheme. Super size. How still can afford depend on location. But car now cannot even with a small car. Take Grab ah. Grab is always cheaper. No cahaya. My house already MOP. BTO two room. Looking to upgrade before fifty five. Advice. If you're holding on to a BTO, likely you will have uh, quite significant cash proceeds. As long as you don't tell yourself, I want to keep, keep the cash. Maybe you can keep a little bit. But at your age, because you cannot loan as much uh, as the younger people. Because as we age, our loan loan tenure reduces so it would be a good idea to use a good portion of your cash to buy the next house and if possible if for example you want to buy a four room use everything and fully pay 
Right there you can retire in peace Sell the house Whatever that you get You hold CPF, cash, everything After less of expenses Use it to fully pay if possible For your next house If you want to take a loan Take a small loan So that it's manageable for you Because you're inching towards your 55 years old Then probably you'll be planning about your retirement right So I think that would be a good idea Bigger house No loan Or little loan Huh? Like the sound of that? Agent Sulaiman say Agent Sulaiman pula Agent Azar Sulaiman say Price too high HDB should control and revamp the valuation system Well I have no choice but to listen to Mr. Agent Azar Sulaiman Because He's my senior And what he say has Has weight has weight to it uh, maybe you can share with us how this can be done sir if I'm working in commission base how do I support myself to buy BTO it doesn't matter BTO or resale or condo if you're commission based then it's a sales job right then it matters what you declare in terms of your NOA I like to put it this way if let's say you earn $5,000 a month, no, you earn $10,000 a month, everything, uh, all your commissions, plus, 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 $10,000 a month on average, for example. Yes, yes, must think big. Okay? And then in one year, you have $120,000, correct? $120,000. What a lot of salespeople like to do including property agent no lah property agent cannot run away because all documented really is they under declare you earn 120 of course have a less expenses you earn 120 but then you declare 35,000 only ah, that's where you got problem because the loan will be based on what you declare in your NOA notice of assessment Ah, so that's the problem there So I think I encourage you To declare the full amount If you earn 10,000 a month And per year per annum is 120,000 You declare the whole 120,000 Sekali end of the year you get additional bonus Become another 30,000 Morning Become 150,000 Then you declare 150,000 Don't scare Don't scare to pay the Income tax You should be happy And proud That you are able To pay income tax Majority of Singaporeans Never pay income Not able Don't have the opportunity But the fact That you can pay income tax Means you are uh, Up there already No one level up, two level up already Pay the income tax So that on paper Your actual commission is reflected And then that will help you to apply for your loan A generous loan The loan that allow you to buy Give you plentiful options Whether you want to buy BTO, resale, condo, landed Whatever you want to buy Thank you guys, I'll see you tomorrow Insha'Allah Insha'Allah